90 million voters have already cast their ballots nationwide, and tonight early voting in Florida is over, but a large number of people still showed up at the Supervisor of Elections office in Hillsborough County today. Many of them coming to drop off those mail-in ballots. Others came to work out a few issues. And in your size, Jeff Patterson joining us now live from Hillsborough County tonight. Nothing they can't overcome there, hopefully, Jeff. Not at this point. Good evening, Keith and Jen. As a matter of fact, they're dropping off early votes uh, behind us even as we speak. Steady line of cars have been doing that all day long. Supervisor of Elections Craig Latimer tells eight on your side, no problems to report at this time. Everything appears to be going smoothly and according to plan. And if there are problems, individual voters still have time to straighten things out. It was a steady stream of cars at the Supervisor of Elections office today. One by one, voters dropping off their mail-in ballots to make sure they're counted. Candida Tizone came to pick up a ballot to avoid a long line at her polling place tomorrow. Just have to come and, and get the, uh, the ballot because I didn't have it and then fill it out and drop it off before tomorrow. Melissa Joplin is voting in her first ever election. I'm 46 and this is my first time ever voting. And I just felt it was important um, to support uh, my president. And she felt the need to drop off her ballot to make sure it is counted. I didn't want to do mail-in because um, of who I support and worry that there might be some thing funny behind that. So I wanted to make sure and bring it in myself. Supervisor of Elections Craig Latimer tells Eight on Your Side earlier this week, they had about 800 mail-in ballots that had not been signed, but he has teams of employees reaching out to voters to correct those problems. We had a little over 800 and over 350 have been cured. That was a couple days ago. Um, anecdotally, I had three people yesterday that came here to cure their signature that I just happened to be standing out here when they came up. So if you do have a mail-in ballot in Hillsborough County, you can track that online to make sure that it's been received and then counted. And if for some reason there is a problem, say you didn't sign the ballot or your signature doesn't match your voter registration card, you have until November 5th to correct that. In Hillsborough County, Jeff Patterson, 8 on your side.